Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how you can switch up a red lipstick look with three different lip liner shades. So I decided to go with MAC Ruby Woo, which is a cult fave and rightly so. It's a gorgeous red that pairs beautifully with any skin tone. So firstly, I just wanted to show you what Ruby Woo looks like without any lip liner. I've tried so many reds in my day, but there's just something about this one. I always come back to it. It's a long wearing matte lipstick, but it's comfortable on the lips and I feel that if you want to skip the lip liner you totally can. So the first lip liner I wanted to pair with the lipstick is Mary Jo K by Kylie Cosmetics. So this one matches the lipstick pretty closely but it's not an exact match where the liner just disappears in with Ruby Woo. It has a subtle distinction with a stronger hint of a blue undertone I feel and in person this liner just does something to the lipstick which just really makes it pop. Now in this demo, I've only just lined my lips with Mary Jo K, but if you want more of an impact, you can totally fill your lips in completely with the liner and then go over the top with the lipstick. This makes the color super opaque and makes it even more long lasting. Next up, we are moving on to Burgundy by MAC. And as the name suggests, this is a burgundy shade. This is a great color to create a subtle ombre effect and give your lips some definition. So when I'm lining the lips with this one, I fill in the corners of my mouth too, instead of just lining them. And then I focus the lipstick just in the center. Now, when you're doing this, try not to rub your lips together too much when you're applying, because you'll just mix the two colors together and lose that ombre effect. Lucky last and my favorite liner is the Mecca Max Pout Liner in the shade Super. Now this is a warm brown shade and this combo is my absolute fave way of rocking a red lip. It gives the red lip depth and it makes it look so much more crisp. And a little extra tip, if you give your eyes a dusting of a light brown eyeshadow, it'll tie everything together and look like you've done the most when you really haven't. Now I'm using the same application technique as with the burgundy liner, just shading in the corners of my mouth um, and again trying not to purse my lips together too much. But having said that, with the brown shade you can also fill the entire lip with the brown color and then just go over the top with the red lipstick. Again, this just gives it so much more depth and makes the red lip look very crisp. So this brings us to the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel to see more videos from me. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.